we've talked many times about like the Ivan on text. Um, I'm really sick of bit boy. So I'm really kind of hesitant to even use him, <laughs> but like the, the big influ bigger influencers and stuff. And Ivan on, I shouldn't even throw them two in the same sentence, totally different, but, um, you know, the bigger influencer channels and stuff that have chosen to gatekeep, not talk about Paul's chain or hex ever, or very sparingly, um, to me, more so than Hex, and the fact that we are, we've talked before, Hex is uh, getting into its second cycle here. It's going to prove even more, um, you know, validity to people like that, that maybe um, had their suspicions before, even though they ape into Pepe and shit like that. Right. Um, but with Pulse Chain actually coming and being like a layer one, which everybody likes to whack off to, um, I mean, there's so many different layer ones. Do you think that maybe Pulse Chain has a quicker time of it with these influencers and stuff like that that are having trouble minting their NFTs or whatever the hell they're doing on ETH um, starting to talk about Pulse Chain. Like, yeah. because to me, yeah, I mean, like, there's already not a ton going on. And we were going to get into, like, the, the uh, meme coin season we've been seeing and stuff like that here, too, a little bit, and asking whether that's indicative of, like, are we in more bullish times yet? Like, why this stuff, the Pepe and everything, is more of, like, a bull market type thing. But with all these things happening, do you think Pulse Chain coming up, rising with this huge, crazed community with hexagons, um, does it get on the main page of, say, a um, uh, guy for what's his name? Um, I forget his channel. Uh, his name's Guy, British guy. Um, anyway, uh, totally. Coin Bureau, Coin Bureau, like Coin some Bureau. of these big mecha channels, like. What do you think happens? Like, what, what could it be expedited in Paul's chain? Get on the front page of some of these type places here yeah. over the next couple of months. So, I think one of the big things that we already know is a lot of those guys sacrificed, but they still haven't really been talking about it too much because they don't want to push something that you know hasn't launched yet. So, once it does, believe me, I think they're really going to talk about it only because. We know the Moon Carl, we know BitBoy, we know um, Ivan, we know uh, Box Mining. Some of those guys, we know that they've sacrificed. So mm. once this launches, you, you, can, you can bet on it that they're going to be talking about it. Um, especially, like you said, with this gas prices being the way they are, um, it, it's been crazy. And this is just a precursor to a bull market. Um, and we're seeing 80 to 100 on an average day. There's not much going on. Um, and you're seeing these, you know, crazy Gway prices. I believe it hit 100, it hit 200 earlier today. You know, yeah. it's just, um, I don't even know what time it was, but I know it was this afternoon. I looked and I was over, over 200 again. So, and, and again, there's not much happening right now, especially for for those kind of prices so i really think it, it will be talked about um i think it'll be coin market cap will probably list it um maybe um I, we definitely won't be locked at 201 i don't think um but right you, you know we'll we'll see how how far they go as to as to what they list um because it is a layer one because it's there's different things about it that um will be more beneficial for them to list you know they'll be able to list it on their exchange pretty quickly probably um i think you'll see it listed on a lot of places um so yeah i, I think it's gonna happen exponentially faster uh than 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 what happened with hex and, and, and then it can only really help Hex, uh, you know, because mm -hmm. we will be the main supporters of the network um, and they'll see that the Hexicans are there still. Um, and there's this coin sitting on there that's easy to transact and make some yield on. Um, I, I think we're going to catch on. I, I really think the gates will come down for Hex this cycle. I definitely do too. Yeah, I'm with you 100%. Um, again, because like we talked about it, it, it would be its second cycle gaining more uh, validity to those people, but mainly Pulse Chain. Like I said, everybody loves these layer ones and stuff. Yep. And man, he's just, I mean, Richard's just nailing the narrative right now. I mean, like for weeks, people have been talking about these ETH gas fees. And yep. um, like you said, way up over 100, which I mean, literally in December, 
I was doing all kinds of stuff at 10 way. Yep. I mean, I know. absolutely insane. Hexpassiveincome.com. My friend Crypto Coffee has created what I think is probably the best course for a new cryptocurrency investor. Not only that, but these courses usually charge an arm and a leg. Crypto Coffee is only charging $200. I think right now he actually has a discount for $150. I have a link below in the description. If you are new to crypto, do not understand Hex and how it works, click the link below. It's a quick, easy course. He only gives you the basics. I personally, myself, have thought about creating an intro to crypto course in the past. I don't think there's any reason to do so because Matt Crypto Coffee has already taken care of that. And I don't think anything needs to be added by anybody else. So check it out. The link is in the description and sign up to Hex Passive Income today.